Hi guys, welcome back to another Christmassy video. I am about to go out and head and get some things from Poundland. So my last video, you guys seem to love, thank you so much. And I'm just loving that everyone's here for the Christmas content in October. As I said, it's the only thing I can control right now in this crazy world, in this crazy year. So I'm gonna just crack on and enjoy a bit of Christmas planning. So today I'm gonna to take you over to Poundland and show you what's new. So you, there will probably be some Halloween stuff still. I don't know what's happening right now. My hair is like really big. Uh, there's probably gonna be some Halloween stuff still. And I'm hoping there's gonna be loads of Christmassy stuff. Stocking fillers, Christmas Eve box stuff. Do subscribe if you're new and you like the sound of all of those things. Anyway, let's get going and show you what's new in Poundland. Just had a bag of um, pickled onion monster munch. <laughs> I didn't think through the uh, wearing a mask thing, so that's gonna be spicy. Uh, right, I'm here now, I'm just gonna head in. Just driven past Lidl as well, and I did wonder whether maybe to do a little like Christmas food video, maybe, if you want that, let me know. Because I might do like Aldi versus Lidl Christmas food, or just like what's in them both. Let me know if that's the sort of thing you want. But yeah, let's go and see what's in Poland. <laughs> So these are always a good idea, little books. They've got Christmassy ones. Um, really good for stocking fillers. Another good idea here. Two packs for a pound. My boys absolutely love stickers. Know about yours? Do you have children? Got to excuse my nail varnish. Look how bad that is. Really needs doing. These little crayons uh, we got given once. They're really good to put in stockings. They're useful as well. But I'd show you. All the crafting stuff in here now. Festive. These, I think they are actually a pound. Uh, they'd be really good in a stocking, wouldn't they? I hope you can hear me through my mask. Loads of toys here. Look, like these dolls are a pound. That would be a good stocking stuffer. Jewel tattoos. That's cool. That's a pound. Guys, there's loads in here that you could put in your stocking. This would be a nice Christmas Eve box item. Two pounds. It's really good. It's a one. Also, these are like little Toy Story squeezy toys for two pounds. Really good for Christmas Eve box. <gasps> Is this Polly Pocket? Oh my gosh, actual Polly Pocket. Two pounds. Love that. These are actually really good for Christmas Eve boxes to give them something to do while you're busy doing any prep you need to do. Card making kits. That's quite cute, isn't it? Little finger puppet making set. We're getting those each. We're getting into the festive aisle. We've got Halloween stuff up there. I'll show you that in a minute. So, we've got lots of little bits and bobs in here. I like that doormat. Little lights. We've got quite a few little makeup y bits for older children or bath bombs. Those are a pound. Little makeup sets. If you've got older children, I don't know what. I wouldn't put this sort of makeup on young people's skin. I don't know, probably wouldn't put it on mine either. <laughs> I break out at anything. What are they? Oh, lip bars, that are cute. Yeah, they've got kind of like a lush vibe going on in here with these things. So they'd be good for stockings, wouldn't they, for older children? It's quite a good little these present. These are like little secret Santa gifts for like work colleagues. If you're doing it on a budget. Games. I don't know what he's thinking when he rather spend his Christmas all the day with someone else. I guess he stopped thinking about me. Yeah, yeah. I don't know what he's thinking. 
When he says that he's been driving all night, all day To celebrate Christmas with me These would make a good stocking fitter for older children I'm going to show you what's in here for Halloween Although it will only be here for literally like another week and a half as soon as Halloween's done, they literally just get it all out that night and get all the Christmas stuff in. So this is going to be obviously gone, filled up with Christmas. But I did want to show it to you just because it is quite a large part of the store. Maybe I should have done a Halloween one. It does feel a bit like I've bypassed um, Halloween. We're going straight to Christmas. Is, everyone, is that a bit early? This made me lol. All I want for Christmas is you to buy me lots of presents. That's so good. I wonder how much that is. I hope they're not a pound, are they? Probably be cheaper than that. A little elf one. What well, is your favourite Christmas art, uh, film, guys? Let me know in the comments. I hope it's a puppy. They're good, aren't they? Ah! <laughs> These are making me lol. These boxes are good, aren't they? For if you bought something for someone and you wanted just to make it look a bit bigger or like something to put it in. They're actually a pound, those ones. And they've got some nice Christmas card sets as well. And also, oh, this one which is for children, schools. Oh, they're good to make wreaths with. Oh, jingle bells. Oh, these are great crafts. Little wreath making set. Loads of stuff here as well. Obviously, forage for those, but some nice little sets here and some really random other things. Poinsettias, little Christmas hamper set as well. Make your own baubles. Confetti. Oh, and a random bottle of Ribena. Yeah. What is a stocking without some chocolate? What do you guys go for? We usually do coins. Music good for the tree. Little selection boxes. Oh, they make me so happy. Advent calendars as well for a pound. Quite a few different ones. On to more like non Christmassy stuff. I showed you the strange last time I was in here. I think they've got a bit more now. It's all very cute, isn't it? I like that pot. I have this on my gold unit. That's really nice, isn't it? That metallic pot holder, pot thing. <laughs> Three pounds, These little pots. I mean, I'm not sure about that. I don't know if it's a bit big for anywhere we would have. Candles. Pretty frames. Oh, incense holder. These big prints as well. I won't get them all out and touch it. But. Tassel tea light holder. It's a bit big for a tea light holder, isn't it? Look at these little serving dishes. Wouldn't that be cute for Christmas dinner? I really like these mugs. That would be for me. Adult dish, spring fill. These are good, aren't they? Because mine gets so stained. I also do the toaster pockets as well, which I really want to try out. I love a cheese toasty. I'm going to get a few little uh, happy birthday bits for Stu. His birthday is on Halloween. I'm going to get a few little banners. This extra wide, five metres of wrap. That's good, isn't it? How much is that? Does it say a pound? Is that a pound? That's good. I might get some of those. I've got like mask face from like no makeup left on it. Um, yeah, so that is all that is in Poundland at the moment. I will be doing another video soon because I'm sure there's going to be so many more amazing things in Poundland when it comes closer to Christmas. Don't forget to subscribe and give the video a like if you did like it. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you soon. Bye!